Hey guys, Harley Moon back with you today. It is Sunday, I think, uh, <laughs> August the 23rd. Yeah, 23rd. So, just out for a little run. I haven't been on in a while. Uh, I didn't get back up to uh, the uh, damage from the hurricane, the tornadoes, no hurricane, tropical storm. And uh, so I really haven't done much in that aspect. I'm just out for a run today. Haven't been out the past few days because every day it looked like it was going to pour the rain like it does today. Uh, we've had a 15 to 20 percent chance all day today, and I've kind of avoided it coming out until now. Said, so, well, if I get wet, I get wet. Uh, I don't think I'll melt, right? Other than that, it's been pretty quiet around home. Oh, nice old Ford there. Yeah, I like that. I don't know if you got to see that. Look like a 49 or 50 or something like that. out in my Jeep today I had to go to Harbor Freight for a couple of items but uh, on the way up I'm in the left lane minding my own business and uh, this white car I'm not sure what it was but he was on my right side and as I said, I was minding my own business. I looked up and he's in my lane pushing me out of the road. I had to hit the grass just to keep away from him, the median. And uh, he continues to come on over. He didn't even try to go back into his lane. I guess he didn't realize I was even there. Probably was on his cell phone or something. Doing something crazy. Not paying attention to traffic. And he liked, he liked to hit me, but uh, I didn't have a camera going at the time. I should have had my dash cam going, but for some reason I had a fuse blow out uh, in the adapter that I use, and it decided not to work today. So, not sure why it keeps popping the fuse, but I'm going to have to do some an angle to figure out why I put a bigger fuse in, right? But, yeah, I hit the grass and he come on over in the lane and uh, I come up behind him and he has the nerve to stick his hand out and wave at me saying he's sorry. Well, he almost caused a major accident and there's been a bunch of them on the road here the past few days. We had one down in Harrington as a rollover yesterday one person was partially ejected and didn't make it but it's people like that that cause these accidents that literally can scare the living crap out of you you know I had to go home and change my drawers anyway <laughs> uh, wasn't that bad I survived it but uh, at least I was paying attention I saw him come and was able to avoid him You've got to be on your toes when you're out on the bike, when you're out in your car. People are going to be people. They don't pay attention, and they can hurt you real quick. <coughs> Other than that, my day went pretty good. Uh, done a nice Sunday afternoon, and right now it looks like all the storms are staying away from me and I'm happy so Brown's Branch County Park uh, it's a little park where people come and do a lot of dog walking and whatever uh, maintained by the state got something in the room I think I missed it with all three 
<coughs> Excuse me. But uh, now I've been noticing here lately that uh, a lot of people are blowing their grass out in the road again. Uh, I come through an area earlier that uh, had big piles of it in the road. I guess they just kept blowing it out from the yard until they got it all off the yard and it was in the road. I wish people wouldn't do that, but again, people will be people. That's all I got to say about that story. You know, I guess they don't realize, or maybe they do realize, or maybe they just don't care about what happens to a motorcycle if he hits that grass. But, oh well. That is the story today, guys. And I'm going to shut her down here, and maybe I'll put this up tonight or not. I don't know. Seems like I've been a little lax in getting videos up. Uh, we'll see how it goes. If this one turns out, I'll put it up. You guys take care. Keep the sun, shiny side up and the dirty side down. Ride them long. Ride them hard. Ride them safe, guys. We'll talk at you later. Bye now.